The Rosal Estate MS has commenced preparatory works towards the reopening of the estate. Narima Ali reports. The People's Progressive Party Civic during their campaign rallies highlighted that one of their major projects in the manifesto was the reopening of the closed sugar factories countrywide. Since the party assumed office in August this year, the government announced that works were in the way to revive the estates. Recently, a few re-employment exercises were executed at the Rose Hall Kanji estate where several redundant workers were rehired. Speaking with the Minister of Agriculture, Mr. Zulfkar Mustafa, he explained why this is being done. We have had, I've had a report on the conditional survey that was done. Um, as I'm speaking here, guys, we're still meeting with the, those managers or those point persons. And I'm heartened to know that these estates, um, based on the report, based on the survey report, these estates, they will start to recruit a small team of force and force, and then later on in the year, you'll see more and more people will be recruited. Recruit. But there are a lot of work, because the neglect there was tremendous by the previous administration. They abandoned the estate, and a lot of um, work has to be put in to get back the estate of operation. Minister Mustafa then shared who were being prioritized during the rehiring process. So it's just focused mainly on the redundant workers. Yeah, yeah. The most that the, those those the, those will be the target person for us. Those workers who are redundant or who became redundant, mm -hmm. who have severed, because we'll target those persons. Now remember, those persons. Uh, most of those persons are still without um, employment, mm -hmm. and those are the first set of people who will be targeted. And then we'll go to the other set to see how we can. Be. But over. A period of time, you'll see more and more people will be employed in these estates, Rosal and more and Skell. All right, thank you. This newscast spoke with a previously redundant worker who was employed at the estate, and he shared these details. My name is Kamal Pasad, and I'm from Kainfi Settlement. I was I was employed at uh, estate Rosal. I worked for 22 years before um, the closure. I was a uh, acting workshop manager when the estate closed down. But basically, my position was a supervisor, workshop supervisor. When questioned about how the closure of the estate affected him, he responded by saying, It affected me tremendously because I had to go on a job hunting all over the place and work with private people, private company, and do any kind of work, you know. So it is a very good initiative to make me happy and my family because sometimes I have to travel a long distance to go to work. Mr. Passad is very elated about the recruitment exercise since he was one of the persons who was rehired. It makes me feel so nice, right? It's a very good initiative the, the government do for the people of Guyana because um, a lot of people was on employment or was an employee and they have to go and seek job all about and some people still not work, not present. In closing, he shared these details. Well, um, for the time being on, they, they're just doing a layout plan, right, basically. They're just doing a, a few employments to get things back in stream. Well, um, right now we are seeking employment to bring out a, a skeleton cook staff to work right now. Well, um, they re-employ me back as a, a foreman for the workshop for the time being on. The Rose Hall Kanji Estate is just one of the sugar factories that will be revived by the PBPC government. Narima Ali Channel 8 News.